What's up YouTube and welcome back to another game called the Battle of Politopia. It was requested in Discord so I thought I'd give it a go. I am no expert so you can feel free to laugh at me. Doing the 30 turn 1 just to make sure that we have some end goal in mind. Uh, depending on how you guys feel about this and also uh, relying solely on your expertise to give me an idea of what to do. I don't know like what these do. I have done a quick, quick playthrough. Uh, I used Hood Rick, yeah, the Robin Hood looking guy, and you can see I got one star. Uh, I did win, but I got one star. So, let's go for random, why not? Opponents, one and easy, just to start this off. Um, I would like, actually, no, let's go two. Two opponents, 30 turns, difficulty is 120%. 150%. Alright, what about 11? 159%, that's serious. Uh, I'll put it to normal, because I did do easy on the first one, and it was uneventful, we'll say. Right, there are a lot of things you can do. There are a lot of researchers to do. I'm not entirely sure I understand them all, but what I do know is I am going to get the food straight away. And we're going to get that leveled up. And then I'm going to go for Explorer to uncover some land straight off the bat. Quite a decent amount, actually. And then we'll send this guy over to start onto this village. And take over that. Tech tree in the bottom. For those of you that aren't as au fait with this game like me. Uh, I have done a lot of this. You can see they, they, they go out quite so. I don't believe it goes any further than this, but is where we're at and then of course we've got nothing else now we've, we've done what we can we don't have enough points to do any of these tricks fish or get the food um we can't build any new military because again we don't have enough stars and we've already moved the the characters that we have and there's nothing for him to attack so and turn 29 left and immediately we go straight on to that so what i'm actually going to do is quickly just get this because this will level up the settlement once we get obviously to the limit and then for the third turn we might see some actual action right so there we go we can move him there onto that now and at the end of our turn they should he should attack that village and have we learned fishing we haven't can we learn fishing we can't it's five so we can instead make or train a new warrior and then battle here. We win. 20 points all around. More to choose to eat. This guy can now move. So I'm going to send him this way. Because we have a village there and a village there for sure. Four points to collect. I'm actually going to get this food as well. That's all the food we can do. Instead of exploring, because we do have quite a good area explored, I'm going to go for the workshop, because I've not actually done it before, and I don't know what it does. Uh, this guy can't move, and we've already got our max points on there as well. So there's six more, so we're going to send him this way and him that way. He's going to this one, he's going to this one. For now, tech tree-wise, it's showing that we have... Enough to we'll get the fish in on the basis that that will allow us to collect this next go, which means this will level up. So as you can see, two out of three before we get to level four on that village, and then this one still needs three. Uh, we don't have any points left over though, so we'll have to end our turn. Of course, the enemies or the the other tribes are in here somewhere, moving about. Are these supposed to be clouds? I think they are, right? Or snow. I'm not sure. Anyway. Move you there. Move you there. We will collect... Um, actually, no. We'll get the fish first to level up this. There we go. And extra resources. Fantastic. Which means we can get this. And this. And it puts this one off. Now, we don't... Oh, we can do a field. No. Farming's eight. Uh, can we 
afford anything in here? No. So you need farming to use these reed looking things. You need forestry to use the trees. Uh, we can make another warrior. Actually, technically we can do two more. War I'm going to do that actually. So now we've got four warriors. Like so. Okay, so we'll get these guys moving this way as well. Because as far as I'm aware, you can move on to there and you can move to there. Um, and yeah, so this I'm going to take this guy up to this area to uncover it. Uh, this guy is going to attack this village next. This guy is going to this village next. And this guy is just going wherever he likes, to be honest. Right, tech tree. Eight points is enough to do farming, right? So we'll research that. This means we can do this now, but obviously you need five points to do it. So let's move over to here. Right, battle there. And we get it. Excellent. Which means we've got all of this food to level it up. Um, this guy, I can't remember where we said it was taking him. This way. This one's this way. And this one's this way. And I don't want any more. So what I'm going to do is just eat the beefcakes. I'm not sure what these are. It says fruit. They look like tomatoes, which you could argue is a fruit. I just accidentally clicked the uh, refinery looking thing there by accident. I didn't mean to do that. So don't. Yeah, I wanted to actually explore, but it doesn't matter. I don't think. If I'm missing something, let me know, by the way. The, the minute there's, there's not, it seems that there's not that much to choose from because, of course, right, I'm building this farm for sure. That'll put that level up. Perfect. And then resources again to give us a bit of a jump. You can walk that way. You can finally go to there. Um... I feel like we might be able to build a bridge. I'm going to take you up as well. So you're going this way. You're going to this way. You're taking out that. And you're kind of just doing nothing at the minute. But that's fine. So can I get this food? I can. And these are all trees which we can't learn. Unless on the tech tree. We could do hunting. Which we do have some of that. So I might go for that. Yeah, I'm going to go for that. Because forestry is after it anyway. So that's good. I should have known that by the fact that it actually showed it. So do that and that will level up you as well. More resources. Very good. So we've got four, sorry, three level fours now. It is telling me I can use my points to make another uh, warrior. But I'm not going to on the basis that I already have more than I need for what I'm doing. So we've now taken over that as well. And as you can see, this place can get upgraded by grabbing all of these fish. And then, yes, we're going to explore from here so I know what's happening. Ooh, that's better. And then I am not going to grab them fish because it's not going to do us any advantage at the minute. You can go this way. You can go to here. And... I can build a port there, but I'm not entirely sure what a port does. Create a trade route through oceans and water to any other port within five tower radius. Using that move, turn into boats that can move on the water. Let's just build it because I can afford it. We're going to hunt this guy to get the extra point there. And we have four points left. I don't... Oh, we can get the fish, which will put that up a level. And we'll get the free points for that as well. Skip to the next turn. And we can take you even further into there. You further into there. There's another village. So at least we've got a target now. We'll take you to a boat. And I'm assuming we're going to bring this guy around to be a boater as well. In terms of tech tree, we've got plenty of points. So let's go forestry. Leaves us with 10 spear. So now I'm hoping we can do some of these. Lumberhawk will increase by one. Lumberhawk will increase by one. Can we get... That's actually... That's unfortunate. Anyway, 
that's all the points we have anyway. But there's no other forests. So I can't see that I can do anything new there. Right, put you there to uncover. There is one of the... Find all four lighthouses to get the eye of God. Now, I've never actually done that before. On my previous game, I only got to two. Um, this guy is going to go onto there. What is that? Wild animal. Cool. Okay. Um, this guy is going to come here. The boat is going to go to there. Because I want to try and get this as well. You can't go any further. You're still trying to get me to make more warriors. Um, actually, I'd rather go into research. So, archery, mathematics, aquaculture, sailing. Construction. Now, I need help on where I go with this. Um, your thoughts on this will be greatly appreciated, because I'm not sure, looking at the man, before I start going into the hard and extreme levels, which I will do, um, if you want to see that, I need your support in... I'm going to build another one, because I've got the points for it. Right, let's do this. So, we'll fight here. Hopefully, that means we'll win. We shall. I am not... I don't know if walking to that matters, so let's do it. There's some stars around. This guy can now go on to here and fight that for when we are done. You can go there. It looks like we can only use one port at a time. So if I can build you there. Crap, never mind. I didn't mean to do that. I clicked the wrong button. Anyway, I'll make another one. We'll send these out on these docks out and then to where they need to go. These are stars that you can gather. You need to research navigation. And I'm assuming it just gives you like three points, right? Uh, there is a farm over here we can do, so I am going to. And actually, yeah, workshop. I think it just increases the population. It doesn't actually give you anything, right? Correct me if I'm wrong. We'll get this done. That's looking nice there. You met the leader of the boat. Or of the mighty civilization. Discovery of the Kuros tribe gives you one time trade boost of five. Excellent. So there is an enemy. I'm not sure if they're always enemies or not. This is a ruin. Move unit here to examine these ancient ruins. Okay. Uh, in the meantime, we are in fact going to try and get this leveled up. Uh, as best we can. That's exactly the one I wanted. There is a warrior here and a warrior here. We still have seven points. So... It doesn't appear that we can do anything else over there, unfortunately. Um, seven points. I'll chuck. And there we are. We've connected to your city. That's good. I don't know if that actually means anything. It gives us a point. That's good. Um, but more importantly, that means that I can create a worry here, chuck him straight onto the boat and send him on his way. There's clearly a boat coming out here, but we are going to attack this and take it immediately, along with the... And I'm going to go for that as well, just because it's in the perfect place. Why would I not explore as much as possible? There is our second population growth for sure. There we go. And then we'll get this one as well. And then finally, chuck a trade route there, which will link those up. And more resource points, because why wouldn't you? We're then going to send this boat this way. This guy can't move any further. This one needs to move over here. This one over here. And this one towards the docks. Uh, and how many points do we have left? Ten. So I would chuck out an extra person there. Eight points remaining. Is that enough to research anything? No, it doesn't look like it. Okay. Nearly halfway, and I want you to jump on the boat now. I want you to continue a bit further, actually. You to go onto that boat. You to go there, and you to go there. And then basically, just slowly but surely, bring these over. What is that? Field fruit, okay. 
Now, of course, it wants me... If I... Does that increase the population? I don't think it does, but we'll try it. No, it doesn't. It just gives you a few points. 28, though, that's a lot. So we are now going to... Destruction is expensive. So we'll enable the following. Burn forests and a windmill. A windmill increases population. Sure. Not sure where you've been. The wind. Aha! Right. So, can I build a windmill there? I can. Which should take that to the next level. Perfect. Border growth. Yes, now they're connected. Excellent. Right. Uh, where else are we looking? I could do with a windmill here as well if it will let me. No, I can't afford it. We've only got two points. But. Oh, is this the same turn? Oh, it's the same turn. My apologies. Don't know what he's doing. Right, halfway. So for sure, I am going to take you this way to try and unlock that windmill. You also this way to unlock as much as we can. You can go there. You can go there. And you can go there. Good. And then we'll keep moving these up. Not sure what that technically is. East, maybe. And then this guy also into a boat. Now, can we? We've got 24 points. I'm not sure why I can't. Oh, I can. I could just do that. That'll pop that. Super unit. You can now construct Park of Fortune. This epic monument will bring wealth and glory to the nearest city. Okay. Well, this is a level 6. So this super unit is going to go next to it. Super unit sounds good. Don't know if it is. We will find out. Right, now let's clean up some of these tattoos that are free. Uh, we're going to get that first. And of course... Are you connected to that? You are, so we'll level you up to level 6 as well. Another super unit there. Okay. And... Again... This is where you need to give me tips, guys. If I'm doing something wrong, I'm hoping on hard at border growth squad. Yeah, which will allow us to get the farm and the, the animal there. Right, so I am going to immediately do that and immediately do that. Right, movement wise, you go there. Movement wise, you go there and you go there. Uncovering. I'm going to take you on to the land here. I'm going to take you on. I'm not entirely sure that's safe because. Will they attack me? No way to find out. Right, and you go this way. Super unit onto a boat. Yeah, super boat. And then super unit is also going onto a boat. 40 health damage, whatever that number is, versus these guys that have got 10. So they're four times stronger, which I have to, have to admit that is quite significant, I would expect. Right, we have 18 points left. And we need two population for this. What does burning, what does burning the forest actually do? Transforms forest into a field with crop. Oh, okay. There you go, level six there. Does this give, which increase one, you also get a pick of an additional reward of the super unit. Because I don't want to just survive to win, I want to destroy to win. Yeah, they attacked him there, look. Right, so we'll chuck you on a boat. We'll chuck you out there. We'll chuck you out there. There is the... Ta oh, and perfect. Another village as well. Right, you are going to go this way. You are going to go this way. You are going to go to there. And you to there. And you're going to eventually end up on that ruin, right? You're dumb. You're onto that village. What else, people? Bring this super unit over as well with 32 points spare. 
uh, strategy gives us defenders and a peace treaty. Um, mathematics gives us a catapult and a sawmill. Navigation gives us those stars. So I think I can probably do something with them now, but I don't exactly know what. Right, apparently I lost that battle, which was expected. Don't matter. <clears throat> Right, loads of points, and we have our super units ready here. So I'm sending you in that way. I am sending you that way. You to there. You to there. I'm going to send you around the houses. You to the nearest dock. And then these guys just keep heading north. Here. I. Whoops. No, I want to do that. And then one more, hopefully. Should pop that up a level and increase growth. That's actually what I wanted to do. That's good because then I can build a port there. Good. Right. And that will link them up as well. And then finish off with some free fish. Making sure to collect all that I can in range. I'm not sure how I collect these stars. Maybe I have to move on to them. Uh, still 16 points left, but this guy hasn't moved yet. So let's move him to that main city there and uncover it. I think that is it. 16 points is enough to... Defend bonus. And archers, but I'm not too worried about those right now. Right. Did he just insta-kill? There's a baddie, right? Yeah, he's having problems. Tell him is the battle to get the gate of power. Okay, no problem. I'm going to bring you on here as well. You need to battle. You go in there and you'll come into that relic. You're going to battle there. And of course I'm going to get all these fish to get this leveled up ASAP because I want to get it on... Actually, I'll just do that and connect it to the trade. There we go. And voila, how many more? Perfect, more of those, keep it going. I just need to get up there now for the fourth windmill, not windmill, lighthouse. Um, you can keep going that way. Actually, I am going to do that now. So that should unlock that. That's all four of them, right? Super unit. Right, I construct the Eye of Dongle. Eye of God. Do it. And then you walk towards the boats as well. You continue to that. You can actually go on that relic first before you leave. I don't want any archers, to be honest. I think we're good. No, we're not. We've got all this to do. So we'll get you. We will get you. And... We'll uncover all of that. I'm sure I turned on two, right? This is only one. Am I going mad? Maybe I'm going mad. Let me know in the comments. I swear I set two enemies or two allies, whatever you call them. Right, I'm just going to boost this up because it is on its own. Also, I can't afford to... Are these just normal trees? Yars. And yes. There we go, border growth, that's what I want. And then I can put a port there as soon as I can afford it. I'll continue to uh, go there. Right, I think everybody has done what they need to do. They're really pounding that guy. Um, right, we'll take him on the ground there. We will take you towards that ruin. We will take you towards that ruin. We will do that. You encountered a mighty swordsman who decided to join your tribe. Thanking you. 
All of these go into the boats to fight, hopefully. You're coming over also to fight. Right, what else can we get here? I'll go climbing in case we do get into some problems. And then just with the remainder I'm going to... Actually, before I use all my points, I need to connect that to the trade route. There we go. Right, so that's all of them connected. No problemo. Get you on a Bert. Get you on a boat. And you're on a boat next. Yeah, you're on a boat next. Um... Yeah, I think... That will do. They're coming in to attack this super unit. And... Bring you to there. Bring you to there. Right, this super unit can make its way over. And this super unit can make its way to the dock. This super unit can make its way over. And so can the swordsman. Of course, we'll fight this. You can make your way to the dot there. You're good. Oh, by you. There's not really much I can do here, I don't think. We can have a bit of a fight, but I've got a feeling we're going to lose. And then, of course, we can get you coming over as well. 52 points. I'm not sure if there's anything that makes... My guy's like stronger. So let's go there. There. Eh. I want this to build you up and hopefully get you leveled up. We don't need to explore, so let's just increase the population. Also, chuck down another farm and then harvest that for a level up. There we go. More resources done. What are the other ones looking like? I could train a unit from the city. I'm not going to though, right. I'm not entirely sure. Upgrade to scout. Upgrade to... Wait, you can only upgrade ships inside your territory. Okay. Didn't even know that was a thing. This is inside my territory. So do I need to put it on a star to upgrade? I'm not sure. Yeah, they're, they're, they're obviously attacking my super units, but my super units are indeed... Gather stars, recover. Okay. And then I'll bring you in to attack more. You can attack that guy. We'll gather the stars. We'll, of course, get this. More research. We'll send you into battle. Is that place on fire? We'll bring them round to defend. We'll, of course... Can we click on this? Doesn't seem it's allowing us to actually do anything. So let's train a new unit there. And a new unit there. These are defensive units more than anything. And then we'll bring you over there. And we'll bring you over there too. Very good. And then there's this guy here that I can just smack at that for the sake of it. I really don't like my super warriors, but he's, they're doing damage. Right, he's just took my settlement, so that's, that's not good, I don't think. Um... 
and bringing in you as well. And we'll, of course, get these to defend ASAP. And can we gather the stars? We can. But that loses the movement, which probably wasn't the right thing to do there. I'm not sure. Uh, we'll get those. We are now surrounding all of those villagers, I hope. And then... We can bring him around as well. We'll train a catapult for the next round. And come in. I'm not sure how you kind of keep these because killer was completed you can now construct a gate is that it gate of power okay and a temple and a sawmill will that level me up it will another super unit Right, is that there? We should get that back with any luck now. I'm not sure what this is. A rammer. Fair enough. That's exactly what it is. And we'll do that as well, because why not? Catapult, can we build another? Whoops. Need to click that. Can't. Okay, what about this? Catapult there as well. Good. You can take over this village. You can come into this territory and you can come close to this territory. Right, I think... I may have turned it round a bit. I'm going to leave you there because you're next to that village that we lost. So I'm hoping that means we get it back. Apparently not. Oh, unless this is it. Yeah. So then... You do that like so. And send them in and send them in. And attack that. And that. Right, so the catapults are defending from the boats easily now. We will, of course, collect that and build a temple to the block. Uh, we'll get the camel or whatever it's supposed to be. And that will level us up, right? Yes, super unit now on board here as well. So I want all of these units to start moving over to this direction. And you can now go directly into their castle there. And you can come over for the backup. I think at this point, I'm happy to end. That super unit is... Yeah, we've taken that back. Okay, and then bring you over, bring you over, bring you over. Making sure to bring the way from this side over so that nothing gets behind me. Um, and is that... Can you not... Hmm. Right. You're in range of that. You go here. Let's get this back. into a boat let's get you into a boat I think most of these are moved over nothing can come from behind I should have got that ribbon there really but don't matter we'll get you on a boat and basically we've cornered them now as far as I'm aware we'll research that and continue that super unit is taking a pound in, but so far he is fine, and we've now brought in the cavalry. You can go there, and then you can continue to go this way. Um, you are... Upgrade the ship. 
nicely done. Upgrade the ship. And move to there. Okay, good. You go there. Upgrade the ship. Yes. Excellent. And you go there. Right, so we've got bombs or bombers on the boundary. I'm not building any roads because at the minute I'm not convinced they're doing anything for me. Uh, we will get this camel. Can we try and build something? We need 20 points. We can't afford the mine. That's fine. See what happens now. They're coming in. The super units are going to defend best they can. So you take out that. And you go there. You there. You there. There we go. We'll get you over here. And bring that one in also. Meanwhile, we'll take you out with that bomber. You out with that bomber. Fantastic. And bring over another one. Two turns left. I'll bring in this bomber as well. 79 points there. So let's research mining. And actually get the mining done. To level up this. Population growth. And then we can go straight to level 6. Oh, that's a different one. My bad. Alright, then we'll build a temple to take us to level 6. And another super unit. Right, they're, they're surrounded by super units now. There's one turn left. That is not going to do them any good. We'll take you out. We'll take you out. And we'll get over here. It looks to me like there's not much they can do now. I don't see the point of researching just yet. We can do the Empress Tomb. And we'll build that to level you up. Another super unit. Right, let's do it. That's good. You into there. You into there. You into there. And we'll collect those stars. Because why not? And there we go. Victory. You saw my playthrough there. You saw how I play. You saw what I do. I talked my way through it. Hopefully any tips, tricks and ideas would be good. Um, let me know what I did right and wrong. If you want to see more, let me know as well. Of course... This is a game where I will be going much harder, much quicker, because it's one of them type of turn-based games where I like to have an actual challenge and think about it. Although I was yakking all the way through that, it wasn't that difficult, right? Um, on that note, thank you very much for watching. If you like the video, please keep like. Any comments are welcome. As always, join us on Discord. Take care. Goodbye.